Hi guys, this is Simon with HSC UAV. We're out in the field today in a remote area in Central Florida with our M6A Pro G200. This is one of our many different versions of spraying and spreading agricultural drone models. Uh, today we're doing a test with an aquatic spraying application. It's going to be a great day today. We've got a flight plan set up and it's going to spray this entire area autonomously. Just wanted to thank you guys for viewing this video and visiting us and don't forget if you need to learn more about our drones or anything else about our company visit us at hse-uav.com. Thanks again for watching guys. So right now I'm using the drone to mark my boundaries. I'm flying the drone around the area. This is a really good way to do it if you don't have accurate map data. In this case we have a lot of trees. It's a little bit difficult to mark the points on the map. So what I'm doing is I'm actually using the drone itself to fly to my desired boundary location and then recording the point position. I'll stop it right there, hit record. Oh, that looks great. So I've just marked my four corners in this case. We'll keep it nice and simple for our demonstration. But of course you can add as many, I think I believe up to 300 points in your area. So that looks great. We're actually gonna bring it back down now and we'll finish creating our flight plan now that we've created our boundary and uh, have it fly autonomously and spray this area. So let's go ahead and bring it down and we'll land it right here. So right now I'm not using an automated landing because I'm actually landing in a different area in which I took off. So I'm actually flying in our GPS mode which is holding my position when I let go of the stick. So it's very stable, it allows me to land safely in this area. This is a very tight area for this drone, but you can see I'll be able to land it no problem right here. Also, this is a great opportunity to see just how much downwash there is from the props in the water. You can really see that. Isn't that amazing? So that is, when you're, when you're flying over vegetation, that is really going to allow for a really incredible penetration of the product that you're applying. It's going to be an incredibly solid application. It's going to be a lot faster and easier than doing it from a boat or other methods. So this is, this is a perfect application for this type of aircraft. All right, let's bring it in. Let's finish setting up that flight plan and uh, we'll get it up in the air again. set the swath to a much narrower swath in this case. This is a very small area. So I'm going to set my swath to 12 feet. And we're actually going to crank up the spray rate quite a bit. Uh, we'll go up to 5 gallons. 